By now, you will have heard the decision that the college made to suspend residential activities for the remainder of the semester. The public health requirements and obligations that we have were obvious, uh, and our responsibilities, not just to our students, but to everybody, compelled the decision that it was necessary to suspend. But what made this a really hard decision was the consequences it would have on this place and the importance of this place as being some place that people want to be, where our students engage with one another in ways that celebrate one another, that support one another, where the interactions with the faculty in the classrooms, on the playing fields, um, enliven, enrich, expand the intellectual horizons, the personal connections of the community. We recognize that as we do a remote learning environment, it's not gonna be quite the same in a lot of respects. And students have pointed this out to me. They've expressed their concern about what will that look like? How will we make sure that we're getting that same quality education that we get now at Gettysburg? But I'll say this, just the other day, I showed up at a training session for the faculty and the room was packed and the spirit was positive. The faculty is determined to give our students the best education they can. The whole college is thinking about how do we make sure it's not just what happens in the virtual classrooms, but in the thousands of other ways that we can enliven the students' experience, even from the distance that this decision requires. This is an extraordinary campus and a community that has shown time and time again that we will rise to every occasion and every challenge. With the ingenuity of our students, the commitment of our faculty, the determination of the staff, we are going to ensure that the semester ahead is as good as can possibly be and one that will continue to enrich our students and get them ready for the world that awaits them.